phrase that uh, I think describes it very well. It's a small horse with a big heart. They are a giving horse. Very good. They love to please the people who they're with. Standing between 12 to 13 two hands high, these small, sturdy horses have a rather interesting story. They were the horses originally brought to the Americas in Hispaniola by Cortez and the conquistadors. Matter of fact, it's because of the horse that the conquistadors were so easily um, able to conquer. They've continued to breed freely in southern Mexico right up through the mid-1900s. Then a couple of Texans learned about these horses, these small ponies in the Yucatan, and they thought they'd be great for children. And that's when they started importing them. Okay. And they brought them out by the thousands out of the Yucatan into the Texas. From Texas, they were sold and dispersed throughout the United States and into Canada. In 1958, the Galicino Horse Breeders Association was established in the United States. Many of the horses were used to influence other breeds, such as the Pony of America. The breed is now considered critically endangered, with fewer than 100 Galicinos left worldwide. Galicinos of Sewanee Ranch in Live Oak, Florida has 40 of them. So here we are. Now we're trying to bring the numbers back. People think of them because of their size as just children horses. They're not just for children. They're great with kids because of their gentleness, but their, their strength and agility and, and stamina. And a, any adult could ride them all day long. Although rare, these pieces of living history continue to inspire horse lovers of all ages. We took him to a nursing home and a woman in a wheelchair wanted to pet him and the wheelchair, he'd never seen a wheelchair before. It didn't frighten him at all. He just, you know, went right up and the woman petted him and I think she was 105 years old. She was 105 years old. She was, uh, um, as we brought uh, uh, Monty up to her, she responded with a huge smile did not know that she had been a horsewoman Aww. in her younger years. She stood up out of that wheelchair and said, I want to ride. <laughs> I think Monty was five years old at that time. Yeah. <laughs> so there's a hundred years <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, but the satisfaction to me was to see the smile on that woman's face. I'll never forget that. There they are, living history again. There they are, right out the window. Yeah. <laughs>